Hello. Hello. What are um, we doing today? We're meeting up with Ringo, who's about to come in like 30 minutes. We're in Tokyo. <laughs> we're in Tokyo. Dude, that was so bad. Something. Basically, we're going to be meeting up with Ringo, who's going to be arriving in like five minutes. Oh, five minutes. And what we're going to do is we're not going to try to break, or she's not going to try to break character. And this is your first time meeting him. Yeah, so first time. <clears throat> we're going to see if Ringo buys her accent or not. He has genuine reaction. Yeah. Let's uh, All right. get to it, shall we? Practice. <clears throat> <laughs> I just because I can practice, but if he asks me a question yeah, that I won't spot. expect, yeah. I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna. You be put on the spot. Yeah. Try your British accent. Hello, like. my name is <laughs> Mario. Can you go uh, go shopping? Loser. Uh, What's the what are we know, planning? Greet Ringo, I yeah, guess, the proper way. Let's do this. Uh, let's let's establish my uh, Englishness. Ringo! I'm so tired. Jet lag. Yeah. Did you sleep on a plane, Nelly? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you get enough sleep? Mm -hmm. And it's a bit like, like your belly's over the top. Mm -hmm. So then, like, you want like something with a high, like a higher waist, higher rise. So when you tuck it in, yeah. it's it makes you feel taller. But, but like, every fucking pant you buy is like super, super tight here or super low. Um, but I started, I, I, I started um, wearing girls' jeans when I was like super young, and they're like high waisted girls' jeans. And you could wear them like with boots by like wearing them up, mm -hmm. or you could wear them super low and like bag them with, sne with sneakers. So I was like, fuck, you have to make this with like a super high rise. And you add these. Girls can wear this too. Yeah. It's both ways, right? It is. You it is. Both, like, like chicks are doing baggy shit now. Yeah. yeah is that baggy yeah. jeans right now but, as well? But the thing is, honestly, um, it's like a lot of Asians, they've been wearing girl pants even before people are starting wearing them now because, yeah. uh, you know, like before like skinny jeans and yeah. everything, yeah. people are like, oh, where'd you get your pants from? And, you know, when you go to school, all the Asians have fitted like, pants. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And yeah. Like, where'd you get those? They don't even say it, but if you know each other, like, yeah, I got those. Yeah, those yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 I'm like, yeah, oh, that's normal. I mean, if you know about it, you know. Can we show them how these fit? Look, you're tiny as well, and the fact that that's <laughs> the waist can be completely yeah. adjustable. All you need to put on is a uh, belt, yeah, and you're even, good. Like even still, like how much it's tightened, it doesn't look stupid. Mm -hmm. Test pair. We we are not sure if we're gonna release this, right? Oh uh, no, the, there's talks of like a full blackout period, right? So the whole idea was to have pants that you could wear with sneakers and with boots at the same time. So like this, for example, I think it's like we call it the policeman look. Yeah. Uh, drape drapes nicely over the boot, but at the same time you can have like a large single cuff, show off the boot a little bit. Like you cuff it a few more times, show off the boot a bit more. Fire. And at the same time, it's got a large, like a wide enough hem, so you can wear with sneakers. Yeah, that's the beauty of yep, it. And yep. you can wear it tucked in with a shirt, or you could low ride it a bit later, go for the baggy look. Drape over the sneakers as well. Optionality. And then you have these side tabs so that. It's like a fat ass like me. You need you. Challenge for today is everyone has to stay in character with whatever accent they're terrible at. Oh, it's done. It's done? That's done, yeah. Done? Wait, what accent? Just terrible? The most terrible accent? Yeah, probably what, Australian okay. or British? Yeah. I mean, you're British. I'll just pretend no, to no. be. I'll just pretend to be you the whole day. <laughs> How do I sound? Easy. Okay, no problem. I got it. Are no oh, you seeing this? No problem. My name's okay. terrible. I'm terrible. Into sneakers. Into music. I like coffee. My name is Ringo. I like sade. You know, dantes. You know whatnot. I only wear gold, not silver. Yeah. <laughs>
What it gets you is more guys being like, yo, where'd you get that from? Yeah. Yo, where'd you get yeah. that from? Right? Yeah. And then Very it's true. when girls are wearing guy shit, then it's like a whole different realm. And girls can wear guy shit, changes everything. Yeah. Um, tell, tell them you're out. Bujade baby. <laughs> she literally started this profile for Bujade, so gangway. Yeah, mate. Yeah, mate. Gangway. Headed out to Beauty and Youth. We stocked a whole pile of vintage denim, vintage tees, everything. So let's check it out. Yeah, look at this kind of like bow mm. And like the vibe, the, yeah. the, the font and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's look the how, green, look, look at the that, green. That curve I know. a little bit, you know? Dude, type, typography, typography. <laughs> it's all about design. Changes everything. Changes everything. Graphic design and behind design. <laughs> Did you know that was a complete accident? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it probably is, I'm not gonna lie. Am I? Take like a good one. Yeah, yeah. Scared. I think I need to, wait, I need to record this. Sorry, I'm gonna. You know what would be sick? Oh. <laughs> and then, like, the film. Where are you going? Where are you from? Me, Mario. <laughs> you have to, yeah, you have to, like, get in super close and just do, like, a lot of, like... That is freaking high. Move around a lot. Um, I'll Gildan! Oh, it's really Unbelievable! Gilded. But yo, look at all this new stockpile that they brought in, like literally last week. I didn't know they stocked Bujade as well. Yeah, what? No way! How far? It's got the same sort of... Um, American accent, please. It's got the same sort sort of uh, button fly as like a military shirt we've been seeing. I feel like uh, it's definitely a reference piece, is what I've been going the on. The color is sick. Yeah, the collar's not bad. <laughs> So, so what do you what do you look for in a in a vintage tea? Would you say like what's the main determinant that you would say I'm copping it? Uh, I think it has to do with the fabric. The fabric's the number one thing. The color, the fade, it tells a story most of the time. The fit, the fit. Um, used to wear like a much larger, extra large drapey tee, but now have been changing over to more of a fitted yeah. sort of look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so let's say from this stockpile. What would you say is like, this is sick, but you won't buy it, like... I won't buy it. <laughs> <laughs> buy it. I won't buy it. I won't buy it. But like, oh, clearly you're not going to buy anything from here. No. So like, let's say... No, I'm not going... No, but I mean, tie-dye is pretty in right now. Um, Grateful and Dead, but I'm not really into that. Um, I like, the first thing that strikes to me is the, the coloring and the fade. The fade. Yeah. That's literally the first thing that gets me for every tea. It's a, it's a main song yeah. of like a vintage tea. Yeah, and if it's white, right. it has to be a bit yellowy and a yeah. bit yeah. disgusting, but um, yeah, I mean, it's cool. Like this right now. Let's see. Claire. <laughs> Claire. Right? I'm kind of feeling this right now. I, I, I'm feeling it too, Claire. <laughs> I know tie-dye is like a very mixed yeah. opinion, but I feel like it's in right now. I mean, it's cool. I mean, look look at here. Hold this. Yep. It goes with what you're wearing right now. Yes. Like a wash denim. Right? Ew, chrome Ooh. hearts. I've got corsets on my denim. Yeah, but actually it's quite fire. Fire. Fire? Fire. Fine, yeah? yeah, but I mean, the are you, only issue is how, that. How much is it? How much is it? Sixty bucks. Yeah, 50 I mean, bucks. but the only issue is that way too long. Yeah. So what I would say is like. Ken just oh. wants to show off his Chrome Hearts belt. That's all. <laughs> you gotta show that. Fam, you gotta show the cross. <laughs> so what I would say is I would chop it up, twenty six inches. Yeah. A little bit wide, but you know, maybe chop it off too. Yeah, but okay. So if you had the choice between tie dye or like a, a like a classic vintage, classic vintage is always uh, yeah. Always but you know what? Maybe 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 that's just a comfort level that you need to you need to breach. Maybe yeah. that's where you need to uh, tie dye is definitely uh, suitable for summer. So yeah. 
don't be afraid to pull out some colors. Yeah. Uh, I mean, obviously the classic tees are always going to be timeless. Um, it's just a matter of what type of band you like and the fit, the fade. Where is their uh, usual pile of uh, Like these grails. are like the grails. I mean, the grails, it's all right. Like a lot of rock tees. Not many rap tees, obviously. I found a really sick vintage store. It's called Portration, and it's only rap tees. <laughs> but back to the point, like, okay, let's say from this stockpile, like, this kind of fade with, like, how the graphics are. Yeah, that's fine. It's paper fading, thin, too. Paper thin. High cut. High cut. It has to be tight on the collar. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Not drapey. Yeah. If, if you want that drapey, let it drape as you wear it. Like, yeah. The age is going to take care of everything. So yeah. that's the whole ethos behind our brand as well. It's like we want the appreciation of age and natural wear. Everything is going to break down as a strippy and everything is meant to be worn. So it's the mindfulness of your... My boy just did that in an Australian accent. That was a three-quarter Australian accent. That was pretty fire, though. Fire. For your perspective on the perfect denim, what would you say? Um... Well, it depends on the color, I'd say. If you want it to be blue, it has to be faded nicely. It has nice contrast between dark and, and light blues. Um, that's a bit too light there. I mean, you spend a lot of time looking for the color first, and then you look for the fit after, but the fit's the fucking hard part. How about you, Claire? Hmm? What do you look for in a vintage garment? I... Oh, British, British. Oh, I love... I love faded tees. I love... I love faded tees, and... I especially love it when you can see the cracks in the uh, graphic. So I'm gonna see a bit of that in our collection. She's washed. Absolutely killing that accent. So I know. Really? That's what I'm saying. <laughs> it's almost too easy for her. You know, I'm like too generous right now. You sound like Hermione. Yeah. Guardian Leviosa. Uh, Leviosa. <laughs> <laughs> is this mine or this is yours? Which one's whose? <laughs> Which one? This is mine, for sure. You don't realize that like there's so many different types of print. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. you have like, I don't know, you know, we were looking at that book. Um, so we we're trying to sample some teas, and there was just like a thick, thick book full of Prince. different types of uh, ways you can print on teas. Um, and so there's a lot of textures goes, and yeah, stuff like that. Lots of effort that goes into. <laughs> Which it. mostly, honestly, can be inspired by vintage, exactly, right? Exactly. So stay tuned. We're gonna check out Chicago vintage store. Uh, pretty well known here. They changed their name though, it's crazy. It's painter, it's kind of pants. Painter kind of pants here. And uh, everything is literal original pieces with like paint on it. It's like hard and stiff. Yeah, the panels. Yeah, the panels too. How sick is that? The paint. Isn't all... that like the workers pants? It is, it is. It yeah. really is, they sell here. I dig it? Yeah, I dig it. I like that. Yeah, I like this too. Saying, I'm saying like wearing it a really... Hey, you're breaking character here. Saying, I think he has to chug a beer. I'm saying okay. wearing... wearing like a I real... think he has to chug a beer, didn't it? Didn't it? <laughs> didn't it? Didn't it? Mm. Panels. We're just taking it off. Wow. I think I had a deja vu. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Blime it, homie. Like, yeah. like, how does it fit? Fits probably like Kanye, you know? Foxy. Foxy. Yeah, literally. Just gotta tailor it a little bit. Mm. Yeah. I really like the. Uh... Mm. Yeah, the, so this thing. Yeah. I'm ready for walk. <laughs> like cropped in the. <laughs> yeah, like cropped. Body. Mm. And then... <laughs> it was like you about to go to work. Foxy, mate. You <laughs> think? Yeah, kind of a... Is it? Can you have pockets? Pockets and then buttons. Yeah. And then look. It's the same. Yeah, I like, I like this too. Just the same exact... Ringo, that might be your uniform. 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 <laughs> yeah. uh, I don't know how I feel about the patches. I don't like the patches. I'll probably take all of them off. Yeah. Um, I like the zipper and the yeah. button idea. Probably um, the jacket should be tailored a little bit more. And then... Obviously, tailor everywhere else. And then have the pockets up here, layered. Yeah, layered pockets. And then, yeah. 
I think it looks better with the black. Yeah, it looks better with the black. Right, Clario? With the black. What's your, what's your input on this? Um, Ringo looked like a, an asparagus. <laughs> Wild Skepta in action with the bucket hat. I said, babe, man's not hot. Never hot. I tell a man's not hot. <laughs> on our way to Domicile, a very popular streetwear clothing store out in Tokyo. Backside of Harajuku. Let's check it out. <laughs> Come on, Ringo. Come on, Ringo. This kind of building is very like old school. And then they put modern lighting to make it uh, very Tokyo, do you know what I mean? And the tree. And the tree. tree. ASAP Rocky loves this place. Really? Yeah. Okay, it's supposed to be wood, but they modernize it by doing yeah, metal and wood green neon light. Vibes. <laughs> After you. After you. Lad. Look. Look at these side ideas. It's all handmade. It's um, how much is it? Two hundred bucks. Oh no. But it's handmade. Cut and sew. Everything is done and drawn with hand. So. For I think the idea is cool, but I don't know about the price. This is what I like specialize in. Like I love oh, public media, yeah, so I do oh. graphic design and um, publication. How did you get into it? Um, uh, I don't know. Just like first year of college, I took a design class. Yeah, I just did a design class. Um, I used to paint a lot in high school, and then I just got into design in college. It's so hard. Yeah. I like opened up Photoshop and I was like, I'm not doing it. I just read the graphs studio somewhere, but yeah, this is definitely worth trying to take. Yeah. There's a graph. You dig. <laughs> you dig. Cool. We out. Hot. Each of the school gets up. Yeah, it does look like a school, right? Blue Sun. I think it's a Japanese brand, but whatever. <laughs> This is the place where it broke Ringo's bank. Spent how much did you say? It's like 1600 bucks. 1600 bucks? Yeah. It's good right there. We'll, well, we'll see. We'll see. We'll just check it out. I don't get why so many people ask what the store is. It's literally called What's Up. I've mentioned it so many times, but it's called What's Up, alright? To uh, reiterate that. <laughs> no retank. So this place don't only have teas, but they also have hats. You know? A lot of hats. A lot of like skater five panel kind of vibe. Sizzler, UPS, Alien. Don't know what that is, but Phantom of the Opera. Tigger. Mad TV, Die Hard, Armageddon, you know, Newport, Man in the Iron Mask, Marlboro. It's a bunch of hats. A lot of shorts too. If you're looking for shorts for the summer, or you're really cool kind of vintage. This is still Ringo's vibe. Shorts for the summer. You know? Do you know? A lot of teas that's not released yet. These are all gonna be up for sale on Saturdays usually. This rack. Not oh, what? This this rack is up for sale only on Saturdays. On Saturday? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they literally just brought it in like a couple days ago. But you see really cool shit. You know? Cool. Oh, cool, Jay. Five. Tie dye. It's in. Um, more of like a comic pop art kind of vibe. All the Wu Tang keys are gone, bro. You bought them all. 
Oh, <laughs> sorry, Mario. I don't like boys in the hood. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let me wear. Let me wear that shirt. It's probably this store is probably my favorite, like vintage tea yeah. store. You never know what you come up with. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> what is that? Oh, what? Oh, that's crazy. You see that? So Do it again. Uh, that's a <laughs> so, Burbergen made a new Burbergen store. Super bright. Just curated for teas and stuff like that for the, for the heavy drinkers out there. Not a lot of rap teas, definitely more like pop culture, rock, you know, shit like this. This. No film <laughs> Pretty cool. Not your vibe though, right? Too puppish. Do you want to check out Union as well? Yeah. 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 As in the shoe or no, the, the store? store. <laughs> We're going to check out Union, the store as well, so... Uh, speaking of... Yeah. Oh, yeah, speaking of... <laughs> Alright, how are you uh, holding up? Um, I'm great right now. Following the uh, the boys. It's bloody hot outside. <laughs> why me? Lot why me? How are the pants holding up there? Lo love the pockets because can fit a lot of things in there. Uh, yeah. And I'm Both cool. legal and illegal. <laughs> yeah. Alright, this is Union, located in Harajuku. We'll check it out. Bring your stuff, taking pictures. We're trying to get in. Yeah. Oh, you Oh, I get it. Oh, oh shit, is it closed? May. May. Oh, they are. May. I think they're closed, man. When are they open? Uh, unless, unless, like, they're just doing it like that. Break? Yeah. Okay, I guess uh, our other option is checking out. Well, <laughs> so. Hi. Alright, let's go. Well. 